Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Sex Tech. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to delete your saved game data on your PlayStation 4. So if I press options, go to upload and download, I can see the most recent save on my PlayStation. So for Rayman Legends, last time I played it was 626 of 2021. Now I can't delete it from this screen, but what I can do is go up to settings right here and select this, and then go on down to application save data management. Then I can go to save data in system storage right here and select this. And this will be everything on the PlayStation 4 hard drive. Now we can go on over to where it says delete right here. And then we can go to the game. So here's Bloodborne for example. I can go to it and then press options on it. And then I can go to select multiple applications. So here's Bloodborne. Then I can go on over to delete. So what I'm going to do is go to delete and completely erase this from my PlayStation and it says the selected save data will be deleted. Let's go to OK. Now I won't see that on my system storage at all, but I can back out. If I have PlayStation Plus, I can go on down to save data in online storage right now. And what I could do, I can download this from the system storage now. So if I encounter any kind of errors with the game, I sometimes do this. I delete the local files and then I download it from the online files. So here's Bloodborne in the online files. I can go to this and then select multiple applications and then I can download the file back to my PlayStation. But if you want to completely delete all the saved game data from the local storage and the online storage under save data in online storage, we can go to delete under here and then we can delete it off our cloud saves as well. So if you're trying to delete a game save, you have to do it from the PlayStation hard drive, and then you have to come to this section and you have to delete it from the online storage, AKA the cloud. So you have to delete it in two different spots. Otherwise it's going to come back and it's going to automatically upload and download for you on your PlayStation. So you have to delete from this section. It's just saying, please wait. It might take a little bit of time to load. But once we delete from the online storage, we might want to come back to this section where it says automatic upload, auto upload. And I have this currently checkmark turned on. So my games will automatically upload to the cloud and it will automatically download to the cloud. So you can see Bloodborne is checkmarked here. So if I don't want this uploading or downloading my saved data, just uncheckmark this and then they won't upload or download whatsoever. So go to these three sections, depending on your need and you should be good to go. Hopefully this video did indeed help you out. If it did, leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more tech up videos coming up next on your six tech.